And we are at the Ilha de Retiro Stadium in Recife. It is Brazil getting set to take on the US in U23 action. One of two games they will play this week, the second coming this Sunday. Brazil tipping off. The yellow jerseys, blue shorts, attacking from left to right as we look. We expect to see Brazil in a 4-3-3 formation. The US expected to line up in a 4-2-3-1. Play back for Lucas Silva. We just saw how quickly Brazil can turn defence into attack. Wendell gets that cross in and there was the contact at that far post. Some of the fans may be claiming for him as he comes back in to win it. And that long ball over the top and maybe a chance but very calm goalkeeping by Ederson. The Benfica man just comes out. Kizaveta trying to get in behind. The goalkeeper calm as you like in Brazil. Attacking at the opposite end, Gabriel Jesus. Long range hit, that one goes just a couple of yards wide. Brazil side, the old conquering side at World Cup. At the Olympics, it's been a, a different story. Three silver medals. As the long range hit comes in, and Horton makes a very good save, and he's not happy. He'll take a special, special strike. And it nearly was just that very good save by Charlie Horton. And a ball switch wide for Fabinho. Fabinho looking for that little return from Fred, and Fabinho continues his run. And Brooks has to make the interception. And pulls that ball back for Silva. And a Brazilian player going down inside the box. The referee couldn't really see it. Another long range hit and another good save from Horton. Long ball forward. And it's Brooks who does very well. Wins that battle. Felipe Anderson had pushed forward. And Wendell with that cross in. Miller heads it clear. Fred the man on the knockdown and gets it to Luan on the turn. And Brooks there to block it. Gabriel with the curled effort and Horton well positioned. An easy save for the goalkeeper. Gabriel just couldn't keep possession. And the ball played through the middle and a real gap here. Horton comes off his line, he's beaten. And Brazil have taken the lead. And it's Gabriel. And two centre-backs still working their way back after going forward for the set-piece. Yes, out of all the possession, out of all the blocks, out of all the chances for Brazil, they get done by a ball straight down the middle. It is a decent ball, it's a well-timed run, it's a good skill to round Charlie Horton and a well-taken goal. But Cameron Carter-Vickers and Jonathan Brooks won't be happy at the way that it happened. Lost it initially, but wins it back. Rodrigo Eli, the defender, he pickpockets. Long-range hit, and the first real opportunity for the U.S. from distance. Maybe just caught in a two minds there. Gabriel, the goal scorer, wanted to play it. Fabinho. Fred. Lucas Silva. Good spell of possession, this, and what an effort that is! And what a goal it is from Luan! Well, the U.S. get their first shot on target at the other end. Brazil goes straight back with good distribution from the goalkeeper. When it comes out to Luan, just takes a little deflection off Sorto. Again, we can't get bodies close enough to this Brazilian team. Ends up bending himself in. Side that left-hand post to the left of Charlie Horton. 2-0 Brazil. And number Dunga managing the side next year. Real intent from Brazil. Real intent from this man, Felipe Anderson. Good hit and good save from Kempin, good handling. Hasn't had a lot of game time, a lot of playing time with Hertha Berlin recently. Just been back in the team. And the U.S. finally looking to press. Kiesewetter goes down and it will be a penalty kick. The first time we've seen the U.S. try press that high and the referee quick to point to the spot. From Dory in the back. He just comes through the back of him. Stonewall penalty and a chance for this United States team to get back in the game. And that is a red card for Dory after his booking in the first half. And he got on the wrong side. And the penalty kick. Is dispatched brilliantly. Jerome Kisaveta steps up. And all of a sudden, the U.S. are right back in his... Steps up and dispatches of it brilliantly. Goalkeeper goes the right way. There is no goalkeeper saving that. Very good penalty. 2-1. United States back in it. Ball played across here. Valdivia, the international man. He's got Kennedy going up outside, and Valdivia, long range hit. He'll have to get back and defend here. Brazil on the counter attack. 
That ball played for George. Looking to come inside instead. Pulls it back to the edge of the box. What an effort that is off the woodwork from Fred. Kempfin well beaten. Kennedy looking to drive forward again. So powerful in possession. Gets that ball wide and Miller closing. Not closing quick enough. Now it's up to the United States to try to go forward, try to get that equalizer. Long searching ball in those central areas and the flick goes through. Toll almost in behind. Zelalem. He's about to play that ball in behind. The cross comes in. Chance. Brooks. And it's cleared. Left foot of delivery from him. He's got Brooks and Connor Vickers. Connor Vickers makes contact. And the header goes just over the crossbar. Toll was in there as well. You see Cameron Carter Vickers goes up big and strong. Wins the header. No, it's an off-balance header, but that is a good opportunity. He could have been communication from Eric Miller. Was he in a better position to head it in? Again, all the normal qualities of a U.S. team. Spirit, defensive, working hard. Yes, possessed all of that going forward. Really lacked the top four for me. Didn't get on the ball enough. The fullbacks didn't attack enough. Um, so I'd like to see a lot more of that going forward. And against Colombia, they're going to have to do a lot more of that because they're going to have to win at least one of those to go through.